Michigan State University Spartans getting set to take on the Oakland University Golden Grizzlies. And both Spartans are finally back home. I thought we really came out strong. Uh, we had them down 18 to 9, you know, coming out of the first quarter. Um, kind of had a let down and then uh, went, to the went into halftime and, you know, really we just, we knew we had to pick it up and coming out into the third quarter, um, offensively we were really good, but defensively, we, you know, we didn't guard the ball, we didn't guard ball screens, um, which is something we got to keep working at, but uh, it was nice to see uh, our team do well offensively today. I was proud of them to be able to gut it out because I mean you could see they just even from the tip from the beginning. I mean, I'm trying to do everything I can to keep their legs, but at the same time, you know we got to practice a little bit too, you know, because we're so young, you know, and these kids are so Taya's new, so we just need more reps and to be able to play well together. Well, the first half I thought we played pretty pretty good defense. And um, we turned the ball over too much. And that was our Achilles heel in the first half. And then the second half, we weren't playing zero defense, and we were scoring. So uh, we got to figure out ways to, to put everything together. And we have a young team, a lot of transfers. So we're just kind of figuring out our role. And once we do that, we're going to be really good. And Tori, trust me, Tori, I took her out for that one minute. She was mad. She was sitting there. I mean, the kid is a warrior, and she just can compete, and she pushes herself, and she, not, if she's tired, you wouldn't know it. Other people, they get tired, and it's, like, obvious to, you know, the 4,000 people or wherever many people were here, 4,500 people that were here tonight, that they're dead tired, and she just never gives in to fatigue because she's, you know, mentally tough. Thank <laughs> you.